Hey everybody. Okay, I'm doing a recording. I found something weird. Here's like this program. You just get it. It's for free. Mac or PC, whatever. Um, You gotta load it up with some clips that you like. Okay, so... I got this folder of like high contrast um, geometric type stuff. So I'll put some of those in there. All your clips have to be the same um, dimensions, like height and width kind of thing. Um, okay, hold on. I'll put a few more. And everybody likes these nowadays, you know. They look great on LED screens and stuff. Um, okay, the other thing everybody likes is booties. So let's get some booties. Um, uh, here's like, uh, like I have more booties. Okay, so this is, um, Labana. She's great. Um, got that Walmart video. That's, that'll probably look all right. Just load it up with clips that, that people like. Um, this one's good. Uh, see, that one was the wrong size, so it told me, like, hey, it's a different size. Yeah. That, that'll be alright. Nope, won't. Okay. Um, and this one's good. No, wait. I'll do this slow motion booty one. Okay, so that's enough clips. Okay, so I'll close that. Okay, so in here, you change this to this. ABC, it's MPEG-4, um, in the configure, press F, change this one to 0, change these to 100, change this one to 1000, change this one to 100, and that's all you gotta do, that was only 4 things, and you probably don't even need that, but that's what I did, and this thing happened. Okay, so, I press OK. I save that somewhere, save, I'm just gonna um, put it on my desktop and call it, oh yeah, alright, so save, and you gotta, um, what you gotta do is before this finishes, you gotta crash the program. If you don't crash the program, then um, weird stuff doesn't happen, and modulate probably won't like your video but if you crash the program weird stuff will happen like it's a corrupt file and then modulate will just put up with it I'm not sure why maybe because I have this um thing parent and it uh, makes your Mac play all the videos shout out to VJ Victorious um <laughs> it uh, yeah it makes your Mac play all the videos it possibly could be because of that or some other VLC whatever did to my computer but unless modulate just always plays AVIs whatever okay so um I'll pick up the video when it's almost done and I'm about to crash the program okay right about now I'm thinking about um starting to crash the program so I go to force quit and find it and I wait for the right moment because, yeah, if you don't crash it, you just wasted all your time. You're going to have a normal file, and the weird stuff that you want to happen is not going to happen. Close enough. Force quit. All right. So I force quit the program, and we're left with this. So it looks normal, right? But when you start clicking around, you'll see, like, You'll see that weird stuff. Let me mute this. Okay, so whenever you click around, you'll see like, it has a weird pixel blend into the next um, image. Whatever is moving around on the next image, but but it don't takes, over, um, takes over the screen pixel by pixel. So it's kind of like data washing, kind of not, because you're going to the next um, keyframe. Okay, and then the best part about it is, um, Modulate will accept this this file.
Okay, so I just throw it in here. It likes it. And then resize it to fit. And I have this one module and it's called clip control. You can click around on that clip's timeline and you can see where it's at. Let me just brighten this up so you can see it a little better. Okay, so you can click around on that clip's timeline and um, you can go to like your next bend kind of thing or um, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so I made a couple of other ones. You could check them out. Okay. I made this one, more butts, of course. There's like some old ladies. They eat ice cream. Um, yeah, you just click around. Here's like, it mixes into a Beeple clip because everybody loves Beeple. Hey, Beeple. Um, and then, yeah, you can mix it into other stuff. Yeah, you know what to do from here. You just click around. Everybody gets excited, goes crazy. You can use your glitch footage. You can use whatever. Just do whatever. <laughs> Uh, what I found is like people or patterns and then a totally different pattern or movement works best um, in this situation like if you have clips that there's no movement but just like a little bit of it that's a cool thing because just that little movement will take over the screen um, let's see if I can find a cool one here uh, let me turn off the contrast again okay so that's happening, and all of a sudden, it turns into a booty, of course. So once um, the pixels, like all the movement has changed on that screen, it'll stop the blend. So maybe just a long shot would work the best. Okay, that's it. Thank you.